carefully protected from Earth's atmosphere in a special chamber, these tiny granules contain material older than our sun. They were collected by a spacecraft from the asteroid Bennu, and the first major study of their chemistry shows they contain pre-solar grains. That's matter from dying stars at least 4.6 billion years old. It sort of really reinforces this idea that we are stardust. So everything that makes up our bodies and our planet originally was formed in stars that were ancestors to our solar system. And we can really see that story inside the Bennu asteroid by looking at these tiny grains that formed even before our solar system. The sample was collected by NASA's OSIRIS-REx spacecraft that intercepted Bennu while it was 200 million miles from Earth and scooped up 120 grams of material from its surface, which it brought back for analysis. It's precious because it is a window to the swirling gas and dust that formed not just asteroids, but planets. Asteroids like Bennu are a time capsule of conditions early in our solar system's history. Meteorites that crash to Earth are contaminated as they come through the atmosphere. But Bennu is pristine, and that's what makes these results so exciting. Space rocks bombarding the Earth early in its history are thought to have brought water and the ingredients for life. And studying samples helps scientists piece together how Earth came to be habitable. Thomas Moore, Sky News at the Natural History Museum.